Hey, welcome guys, part three. This is the last part. Um, so far we have, let's go ahead and save this. So far what we did is we created a simple website. We picked a simple template. We made a little bit of text heading, a little intro to our web design. Imported a video from YouTube, as simply as it just giving them the URL where the video lies in. Creating a little bit of text here and an Aweber form. Or, or your autoresponder form. I'm sure most all of them give this type of code for you to input into your website. Okay, and that's all there is to that. So if we say that now preview our site here, and of course you can take your time. Make sure you know you do it. Make it look more professional. I'm just trying to quickly show you how easy it is. But the basic structure is, guys. Here it is. You got a website. You know you you got your heading. You got text that talks about it. You got a video that you can play. See, you hit play, it's going to actually play. Okay, you got a way to capture their information. They put their name in there, their email, their phone number, hit submit. Okay, it's going to take you to their website. So if I hit submit, it'll take them to wherever you tell them to go. But see, I didn't put an email in there. I'm trying to get ahead of myself. But that's also up in Aweber. So how cool is that for free? And they host this, okay? So. That's a simple website, simple capture page. So next thing, uh, we have a little bit of time here. We can talk about some of the cool things you can do. Uh, the widget box gallery, this is kind of neat. I'm going to drop it here below all the work I did. And so it's loading components here. And I don't know what you're, de you're designing or what your website's based on, but here's some really cool features you can throw in there. You can do a Google search bar. That's really cool. In fact, let's go ahead and just throw it in there. Why not? Oh, here's something you can do. So let's get the widget. Sounds good. I like it. And there's the Google search bar. Now check this out. Let's throw a text up there too. And once you get into more marketing, you can do cool things like that, like um, Google my name and see how I can help your business da, da, da. And it's got a Google search bar isn't that cool so let's put that in red and I'll show you all that when we publish the page it's kind of neat but let's get back to some more of the well anyways you can look at there's tons and tons of different cool widgets you can throw in there um, you have fun with it you got you got website widgets uh, let's check these out it's pretty cool you can put games in there audios you can put social bookmarking uh, tags in there, uh, more social networking here, you can throw all that stuff in there, you can put a MySpace plug in there. So there's a lot of neat things you can do with this site. It's every, everything here is free, so that's really cool. You can put a little game on your site if you're uh, doing games or, or flash video and you're trying to sell it, you can you know, throw this as just little teasers for people to play whatnot, you know. There's a lot of things you can do here. Amazon, if you've got affiliate programs, you can throw in Amazon stuff. I'm not sure how you would link that in, I haven't really tested that, but you do Amazon search, whatever. So, you get the point. You can play around. There's a lot of cool things you can do with that. But this is the gist of it, guys. You really created a nice website. It has everything you need there. It's got a way to capture names. It's got a video where you can hear your voice, see your picture, kind of relate more to your style of training, and uh, a little bit of text, and that's it. So, once we're satisfied with it, go ahead and click Save. We're going to preview it one last time. Looks cool. There it is. All right. I wouldn't put the Google search in there. I was just doing that to show you some of the cool features, but I would never do that on my capture page, <laughs> just in case. And then now here we go. We're going to go publish the page now. So once we publish it, what they're actually going to do now is that they're going to ask you, do you want to use a free domain name? Do you want to, which they're going to issue their own domain name? Or you can do one that you've already purchased. There's places like HostMonster, GoDaddy, you can buy a domain name, all that good stuff. So we're going to just keep it free, keep it simple. And here you can pick a name. So we're going to call this website training 101.synthesite.com all that good stuff so let's go next and what they're doing is they're publishing it so we're going to go ahead and I'm just going to copy this out just to show you that our page is live on the net so let's go ahead go over here I'm going to paste this site into here we don't need Aweber so I don't care about it so you buy Aweber and there's my site guys so Google my name, you know, that's kind of cool. You can put your name in there. And if you've been doing a lot of marketing, your name should be all over Google. And I'm all over Google. I got over 10 pages of my name of different marketing stuff that I did. 
and that would add credibility to your site. I mean, that's pretty cool. Somebody comes in, type your name, and there it is. So that's Google plugin, pretty cool. And again, here's that uh, site, uh, the autoresponder. So if I typed in my name, let's say I put in my web, my one of my one of my of many emails, and my number. I already know my number, so I don't need it. Click submit. It's going to add me to my autoresponder, and it's going to take me to the page I want to take them to. So this would be, let's say, my second page of the capture page. Now this is something I built myself, but you can build that. You can build a second page to go to by just simply creating new page. And it's going to load a new page. It's going to be the second page of this website. See, it's going to keep the same heading, website 101, and you can redirect them to your second page and continue on just building on top of it in this one simple free site. So there you go, guys. That's how you can create free sites. Definitely take your time. Look around. You can put photos in here. Uh, you can put a picture so if you're not good with videos you're shy behind a microphone which is fine for beginners you know that's no problem you can go and put in videos from Flickr or you can even upload there's a place here to upload your photos directly from your computer um, somewhere I don't know off the top of my head I haven't done that in a while but it's there somewhere so there you go you can always edit anything you publish you can always edit so no don't worry if something doesn't look right now you can edit it no big deal Okay, so that's it guys. This is Chris Rutz with United Marketing System and create a free website. So now you guys have some internet power. Go ahead, create your own site, start branding yourself and get out there and start driving some traffic, man. All right, we'll see you in the next, guys. Have a good one.